Well, it's not unheard of for brothers to play for the same college team, but having identical twins on the roster is fairly uncommon. Redshirt sophomores Alex and Andrew Gray have always shared a special bond as twin brothers, and for them, playing college football together is just an added bonus. For the Gray brothers, football has been a way of life. They started playing when they were just six years old, and it didn't take long for these crystal-haired children to fall in love with the game. Fast forward 14 years, and they're redshirt sophomores at the University of South Dakota. Alex plays linebacker, Andrew plays safety. We've never really been apart, and it was kind of scary thinking that we could be apart for more than a couple days. Andrew, the older of the two by 26 minutes, stands 6'1", weighing 195 pounds. Alex is a little bigger at 6'2", 210, but Andrew says that's only because he had more time to grow. This season, they've both seen a good amount of playing time for the Coyotes, and there's no doubt they've been having fun out there. It's, it's extraordinary. Not a lot of people get to play with their brother, let alone their twin. So. It's a great opportunity for us. But don't let the soft-spoken interviews fool you. These two brothers are wild at heart. And if anyone knows that, it's their coaches. Uh, it's fun. Uh, that's the biggest thing is those guys bring a lot of energy and, and both play off each other and, and the guys around them. So they're both disciplined enough and intelligent enough football players. And when it's come to get to work, they'll do that, but they keep things pretty light. And while their looks may be the same, besides the hair, of course, their personalities definitely differ at times. You know, I think Andrew is, is probably the louder of the two. Um, he, he can tell he probably ate Alex's food when he was little. I mean, probably stole his toys too, you know what I mean? But uh, that's probably the biggest difference is Andrew's just a little more outgoing. As expected, after 20 years of life together, there is no shortage of stories between these two. It's one time, our junior year of high school, he got a pass interference on a third and 20. and. I started yelling at him and smacked him in the helmet and then he smacked me back and then we just turned to punches and our coach had to burn a timeout to calm us down. And although the Gray brothers might get in a few brotherly fights every now and then, they are the first to have each other's back on and off the field.